Nico. He is from New York. I've known Nico for several years as well. Um, he's in music, he produces, he writes, he plays instruments. He's coming out with an album soon. So you will be hearing more from Nico. Mm-hmm. K. Michelle calls everybody gay. Everybody. Hey, were you upset when she said that? No, I wasn't upset because I know he's not gay. So why would I let that upset me? Well, you know what I mean? take now hooked up with a, with a white guy. Oh, my you God. Will you guys stop listening to Media Takeout? Please stop it with Media Takeout. The bullshit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay, do you want me to speak on that? Okay. Uh, the other night, a bunch of us went out. He's actually a producer for another show on HGTV called Property Virgins. And it was a group of us out and we took a picture. Period. Dot. End of story. Okay, so there's no truth you guys actually did. No. There's no truth that to anything Media Takeout has ever printed about me ever in life. The, the, the list goes on and on and on. Like I, anything that Media Takeout has ever printed about me has been a lie and some bullshit. Anything. Nothing has been true. So if you go back into the Media Takeout archives and pull up my name, anything you read is some bullshit. All of it. All of it. Nothing has been the truth. So the, the whole thing about uh, about the threesome is get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. I've never really even started, but it really just introduced how many Who the who the hell knows? How do any rumor get started? Who knows? Somebody who knows? Because they because they call us the love triangle. I guess that's where it got started. Yes, Benzino did. Okay, so maybe that might be the No, cause it no, cause it started it's it started before Benzino said something about it. That was that was out there way before Benzino. Yeah, it was before before that it was they were saying that shit. But what's your relationship with Benzino these days? There's not a relationship. I mean if I see him I speak, but we don't hang out and you know, I don't call him what's up. If I see him out, I'll be like, what's up, though? But we don't, there is no relationship. Yes, we went at it. The reason why we went at it was he butted in to something that had nothing to do with him. And that's why we went at it. He said, why are, are dudes proud to have sleazy, sleazo, sloppy seconds or some shit? You talking about me now. That's why I came at him. You want to you talk about anything else? Don't fucking come at me like that, nigga. You wrong. You dead ass wrong. That's why we went at it. It had nothing to do with you. But you want to bring my name in it and call me sloppy seconds? Fuck you. Excuse me, French. Now, now, in this particular case, he actually did something with that. Yes, he did. Okay, how that make you feel? That's what he's supposed to do. That's my daughter's father. So I, I didn't. What was he supposed to get a medal for that? That's what he's supposed to do. <laughs> yeah, we we uh, we apologized. We you know we did all that politically correct stuff we were supposed to do, and yeah. You're in business with Def Jam, and you're helping them sell records. Universal, you're helping them sell records. So what exactly is it for sale, Kanye? <laughs> I don't get it. I'm confused. You know, don't be, you know, fake revolutionary for profit. I enjoyed it. It was awesome. I wish I would have uh, been a part of it. All right, so do you enjoy the, the Eve TV sex tape? It was, it was pretty, it was pretty all right. I had, I had fun watching it.